Mayo everyone, welcome back to Day by Day Vlogs. My name is McKinley Wimburn, I am from the YouTube channel called Jay Wimburn. My Instagram is at J underscore Wimburn. On my channel I document the training with my two Mustangs and we also film a lot of fun videos as well. And with one of my Mustangs I will be competing in the Extreme Mustang Makeover in January. I hope you all have a Merry Christmas and a Happy Holidays and I hope you guys enjoy today's vlog. Welcome to today. Today is Tuesday, a week and a half before Christmas. How many days till Christmas, Miss Christmas Counter? We don't know. We don't know. It's the crack of dawn, you guys. We are up. Seven days, I think. Seven this days. Seventeen. Yeah, maybe seven days. Um, okay, so we are on our way to our barn to rescue our horses because uh, the chiropractor's coming there today. Eight. Eight days till Christmas. First of a couple of mornings this week that we have to be there super early. And uh, we don't want to be late, so let's go. We got Stormy Boy. He's like, I was eating my hay and they just came. No, no, he walked away from us. He walked away from you? Because he was eating. No, he the chiropractor should be here soon. You should get him, take take off his blanket and give him a brush. He gave me a big kiss. Covered in snow. Finny. All right, Finny, you go in a stall. We always save the best horse to last. Hello, handsome. Be gentle with him, be kind, be loving. If you guys didn't see, yesterday Gabby had a really hard lesson. I don't know when I'm gonna put it up. I like struggle with putting it up because it was a really difficult lesson. She struggled, he struggled, he was getting faster and then she was pulling to try and slow him down and then he was going faster. He faster then he got a martingale. Then he got so upset that he knocked the jump yeah. down that he had to stop and then he had to gallop it and not touch it. He jumped the yeah. cross rail okay. that much higher than the cross Yeah, rail. and I couldn't really see it. Last night, it was awful. I brought, I ran out of batteries. I couldn't video hardly anything. Sam ended up videoing Sophie's lesson on his phone. You have chocolate all over your face. Oh, wow. Story of our life. No, clean it. The chiropractor's coming. She's a doctor. I don't like oh. her to think that I let you eat chocolate for breakfast. Clean it. No, Stormy. I'll just say that I got it from the extra. <laughs> and then she's gonna think you don't wash. Anyway, yeah, so then we tried, like there's so much hey. drama in yesterday's lessons with Gabby, like so much uh, product failure, like our cameras, our batteries. I ended up shooting her lesson on the GoPro, which worked out really good because our GoPro is pretty nice actually. And um, then uh, literally we tried a martingale on him. Oh my gosh, Gabby liked it better. Right? Gabby liked it better. Because he would throw his head up and be like, oh, I can't throw my head up and oh my gosh. put his head down and slow down. He threw so many fits. He literally was like, I am never jumping with this. You cannot, that he like was stopping at the jump like I've no, never seen him. No, that's because he got, oh, that's because okay. he was so mad because he knocked the rail okay. down. Yeah, you guys, this actually happened on Sunday too. When we were here by ourselves, he had jumped and he knocked his leg into the rail. I know you guys say wear boots. Our trainers believe that when they're first learning, don't wear boots because you want them to knock so that they feel it and so that they're like, I'm never going to do that again and they learn to lift up their feet. That's what they do here. That's what they believe. Finn is getting shoes for Christmas and the reason is that on Sunday he knocked the rail and he was angry. Oh man, I could tell he was angry and I said to Sam, he does not like to bang his feet. When he bangs his feet, he's like off. Like he gets so mad. He gets mad. It's just like when horses trip, they're like, ah oh, man, and buck. Like, so oh, one thing about Finn you guys might not know is that he holds a grudge. Doesn't he hold a grudge? Holy cow. Anyway, you guys will see that lesson soon. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna like heavily edit it because there's a lot of fighting back and forth. Like Gabby wasn't mean or anything. She just, it just was, it was hard to watch. It was really long. He's training. He's a baby. It was just really difficult. But anyway, chiropractor's here. Get your horse brushed. Who's brushing this horse? We don't even know whose I, horse I is whose anymore. <laughs> Hi, handsome. So this is what Sophie was eating. <laughs> We had to stop at the store because when you have to be out of the crack of dawn. So this is what we were eating. It's a muffin. It's a chocolate muffin. That's all they had at the store. I a bunch of junk food. It was either this or junk. More, worse junk. Sure, I'm like, give me some. <laughs> he is. No. Hey. Gabby's running and he said no. 
Come on. Oh, look at him. He's giving you the nose. He's giving you the butt, Gabby. He's like, oh my God, what is he doing? Oh. He's What's like, what happening is here? Gabby! Ooh. I'm tired. He loves me today because I gave him treats already. Oh, do you want to see something? Ha. 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 Oh. All right, go put him in the cross. She's, She's here. She's <laughs> here. You want to bring Finn in and play? Yeah. The really sad story about today is that I'm going to have to pee over here. Oh, I'm going to freeze. Oh, no, it's not that bad. Peeing on uh, outhouse. Yeah, because it's warm. Outhouse it in winter. Go to the leather seat. Here, Daddy, I'll That's use the good. other person. Go to the next one. Okay. So, storm is all done. Finn's turn. So after the chiropractic treatment, they're supposed to stay calm and no riding. Yeah, you're okay. We're not going to leave you in there. You're okay. It's this guy. You ready for this, Finn? I love our chiropractor. I love catching up with her. Finn was really good. Storm was good. Kitty's like, good, you guys are leaving. So I have one neck for our horses, just one warm neck. And I realize it's Finn has got a neck on his blanket, which is excellent. It's supposed to be really cold in the morning. Oh. So we got our one neck and put it on Stormy Boy. He's like, great. He <laughs> likes it. Does he like it? Aw. Good, so he'll be warm. Aw. I'm going to bring out a little bit more hay because I don't like to, I like to give them a little bit of lunch. Oh, it's snowing. And then Denver's blanket. Yeah, Denver, we know, has lost his blanket, so we're going to try and put that on him too. So, we're ready to go. I tried to take some pictures of the horses. It's pouring snow. Big, huge blizzard. All right, it's a minor blizzard. You guys know how I am about driving in the snow. I just want to say we love you all from the bottom of our heart in case we don't get home. And I just want to say Denver's blanket got like taken off of him for some reason. Some, there's like, his whole entire like chest, you know how it does up at the chest, that piece came on but his stomach straps and leg straps were still attached. He walked out of it. Yeah, but there's no reason why his um, chest piece came I feel like, like undid. It That's the thing about horses. They can do anything. I feel better. Our horses have a little bit of hay. Storm's got his neck on. I am not loving the hay that we got this year. It's got all this like gross grass in it and the horses don't want to eat it. So half their bucket's filled with all this gross stuff. I'm going to have to tell Sam we need to find another hay provider because this stuff is just not what it's cracked up to be. Like we're paying for so much waste. yesterday was that the cord to plug in the water bucket outside was missing this cord here so even though I could carry some buckets out there they would just freeze the water bucket is frozen 
But Sam got it fixed up for me, so it's all good. I am gonna still carry some water out there because it's probably gonna take a while for that bucket to unfreeze. But we put the girls in the field for a couple hours, you guys should know. I canceled my lesson for tonight because one, we had to spend so many hours in the barn this morning. Two, it's a 40 minute drive and I have like a lot of stuff that I need to just get done. Like this and is the week before Christmas. Up. Yeah, so we're just gonna stay home. My lessons will resume after Christmas. While the girls muck stalls, this is my job. I need to fill grain bags for the boys at the other barn. Do you guys know that feeling when sometimes things are going so well and you're like, yes, life is amazing. And then other times the life is not going so well. I feel like right now with the boys where they are, life is going so well. I just feel like things are, things are looking up for us and it's just going really well. But we all know that at any given time, we can take our turn in the bad times of life. But I'm really hoping that things continue to go as well as they are. It's been amazing. And I can't talk to you guys and scoop grain at the same time because I just overgrained him. So you guys are going to have to wait until <laughs> I've done all this. It's so cold that I'm trying to do all the things I need to do today because tomorrow's going to be colder. That is why you should never put things off, you guys. Because when it gets colder, <gasps> oh, it makes it harder to do this stuff. This is all the grain I'm going to take up. That's for the morning bucket at the other barn. This is how I take the grain to the barn for them. I have it all pre-measured. I need to get something better than those bags, so they're annoying. I think somebody tried to clean Stella's stall for me, and that's kind. It's so cold. Um, yeah, oh, you guys are it all. doing water. Fresh water. Awesome. <laughs> no, well, water I don't like it in the corner. Even when you're small, you can still do all the same Look jobs. Okay, you just have to so take new, what? different so measures. She smells like Doritos. You smell like Doritos? No. Do you have Doritos? If you have Doritos, you better share. I had crackers. I had crackers too. All right, let's get I'll done. Let's fruit. get done so we can get back into the house. I'm so cold. mall but we got Nick with us too and I'm in love with his shirt what's it say does the whole thing say it where'd you get it it says clickbait David Dobrik merch David fanjoy.com uh, I we need that love that shirt on you in today's comments somebody asked me what I asked for for Christmas so I'm gonna show you guys right now what I asked for for Christmas oh, this is what I asked for I asked for a Samsung because I like my Android Samsung watch or phone so I asked for a smartwatch, but I don't want the black one. I want the rose gold one. Gabby's gonna be so jealous. But this is just a dummy model. But yeah, it's like this. So basically you can do everything you can do almost on your phone with your watch. So I'm excited. What did you ask for for Christmas? This. Uh oh. You can go with my Mevo iPad? But you have an iPad. It doesn't go with my Mevo. I only like Samsung. 
Oh, you want a Samsung iPad? Hey guys, welcome to nighttime routine. Yes, I always end up doing nighttime chores, which means bringing the horses, but I think we've lost the horses today. But luckily today, all the stuff is done. Like the water's done. Oh, I did all the water. Nobody helped me. That's because I fixed the water tap. Oh no, I actually. Or else had I'd to be lugging it. water. Water's done. The hay is done. The See, crane I did is all ready. The water and then like Gracie's hay. All right, now we gotta look for these horses. It's dark out. I'm gonna need to put a big light out. Give me your phone, then. Oh, it's dark. Can't see a thing. Oh, I see something right there. there. That's probably. Oh Willow. yeah, they're coming. There's Willow, Grace. Yeah, they're Stella. coming. Okay, you're gonna get them. Yeah, give me your flashlight. Where's Why your do you phone? need my flashlight? Where's your phone? At the house. It's charging. All right, there goes Gabby. She's gonna try and bring them in. Just let uh, Gracie come in by herself. All right. We'll see how this works. See if Gracie comes in by herself. Last time, Gracie took off. I'll just close this door. All right, see what happens. Out there in the dark, can hardly see anything. Stella looks like she's running away. <laughs> Stella doesn't like the flashlight. We'll see if Gracie and Willow follow us. See who comes in. Let's see who comes in first. Gracie wanted to call me the other way, but I called her and she came because she enjoyed it. So. Cool. Let's see who comes in. Willow! Hey, Willow. Yeah, Gracie's coming in last. Hey, Willow. Willow, wrong, wrong way. <laughs> slippery for them. It's slippery for them. Their foot, their hooves are full of snow, and ice. She oh, she's sliding. She's sliding. Yes, we know. But you might want to close your door. Good job, Willow. You might need to pick their feet now, right? Yeah. Sliding all over the place. Why is the bottom of your phone white? I set it up that way. Ew. Ew. It's Ew. Gross. It's gross. Oh, no. Good blanky. That is pretty much it for chores. Chores at night are no, the best. No, then we have to do a uh, Willow's blanket. Yeah, we put Willow's blanket on at night. Just to keep her extra warm. But that really is Gabby's or Sophie's job. Putting it on. And uh, chores are really easy at night. Because we just have to bring them in. I'm going to tell you, it's a lot easier not having Storm and Finn here. Especially in the winter time when it's cold. Right, Ruby? Ruby's looking for his, her friend. Can you find your friend? No, she find your friend? Him. Check the hay. Nope, friend's not there. Forgot to mention, I also closed the barn. The big barn doors, I closed them too in the before night. And the last thing we do is, before we can go up, is fill up the grain buckets for the morning. That way they're all ready for the morning. There we go. Grain is done except for Willow's. Willow is a slow eater. She's like Storm. Now we have to wait for Willow instead of Storm to finish eating. All done. It's not in the correct order. <laughs> There's an order? Yes, of how ponies get fed. Oh my god. Slowest, second slowest, fastest. And Stella always finishes first thing, Gracie. I So it goes Sorry, we up. have an order. Gracie, tell us. I feed them I that every them. morning. I feed them anyways, <laughs> any way that I can. <clears throat> I feed them that every morning. Well, that's it. That's it for today's video. See you tomorrow. Bye. Make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.